found this yesterday at Walmart. Well, last night. So the thing about this is they put up the display thing, right? So I'm like, okay, y'all got all these avatar figures and stuff. I highly doubt someone bought all of these, especially at the price that it is in store. Now, when I pre-ordered, it was $25, right? But in store, for whatever reason, it was $30. So I just lost $30 on this bad boy. But got it anyway. Swag, make sure it wasn't wrinkled or anything. Still got the other ones pre-ordered that's supposed to be on the way. But we will see if that get canceled or whatever. So, again, this was all empty, the whole display area. So I was like, all right, you know what? That's it. I'm not going to be able to get it. I'm ass out and all that. But come to find out that I started thinking maybe, just maybe someone walked around with it and just set it down because they, the scalper couldn't afford all of them. And I looked around the first time around. I didn't see nothing. So I'm like, you know what? Let me go back and look again. Maybe someone was still walking around the store with it and then put it back. Sure enough, through a couple of scalpers who must have missed it, it was just laying right there on the shelf. So I picked it up, got lucky. It was the only one. Man, that is crazy. Speaking of the only one, see another pickup I got. This. Now, this tape right here, it's a little sticky, is the lady put the sticker right there. I'm going to show you guys a picture of it right here. And this was the only one in the store. Now, the thing about this is I bought this from Myers like four months ago now and returned it because I didn't have the other Cooperlings, which I have a lot now except Roy. And yeah, when, I'm like, well, I'll find it again. Nope. So I got this from the Toys R Us area in Macy's. This was the only one. And I'm glad I found it. Also got Spider-Man and the Amazing Boy Boys. Yeah, Iceman. Who, I thought I was going to not like it, but the body is okay. Uh, it's a thin one. It's kind of like this piece of Spider-Man, if I'm not mistaken. But I don't have a problem with it. Spider-Man. <sighs> the res is too towards the bluish tint. That's my only complaint. It's not red, red to me at least. And she's okay. I like the new female body that they've been using. Um, also, picked up this, which is new. And I already got this, this, but this, this, and this. Now. These are new um, compared to the old ones. And I'll show you the differences. Um, well, side by side. First of all, here's a hint. The gradient on the eyes. Uh, better yet, on this one. See that? Goes from like darker to light. And it's that print tech. Even on Luigi. Look at that. Really looks nice on Luigi. I just hate to keep giving him this dark blue instead of the same blue as this. But. Oh. And also, Nintendo, if you guys are listening. Do these guys in the Mario 1 colors. You know where you give them red cover on and a blue shirt. Do it. Do it. So, yeah. These are new. And I oh, also picked up the Fantastic Floor because I only get Marvel Legends really unless there's something I really want for under $15. Well, I'll say $17. If they under $17, it's a definite purchase. Got him. You know, I don't know why they're so obsessed with giving stretchy fingers. It's like a little inset joke at Hasbro. I don't know. And we got the thing who I got on clearance at GameStop, actually. So he was like, what, $10? Matter of fact, he was 13 She was 11 if I'm not mistaken, and he was 10 I got to get the uh, Mr. Fantastic 
And let's see what else I got. Got this guy. Got bombastic. Bop, bop, bop. <laughs> and if I'm not mistaken, I believe that might be it. Oh. These. These are cool. This one makes sense to light up. This one, too. Mushroom, not really. So, wish I had the star. Didn't see him. Oh, well. The group of kids out the way, except Roy. This should have been Roy, because Bam and Morton is here. Uh, somewhere in here is Rosa Luna. Bam. And baby reheat. Yep. Yeah. Differences so far. Eyes black. Eyes green, uh, green and blue. Mouth is painted in the inside. This one is inside the tongue. Oh, also, no tar articulation, tar articulation, fuck. Uh, oh, no arm articulation. Here it has wrist swivel. And so far that is all I am really seeing, which is <laughs> a lot. So yeah, this one might be an upgrade. I'm not sure about that toe. I love those eyes, gradients. So these are the newest figures. You guys can retire these, because this might be the way to go. More to come. For the most part, these are the same figure, but old eyes, which just solid color. You know, there's a purple spot under that white dot and the black pupil here. There is none, but there is that printed gradient. Your mouth is a little sloppy on that one. This one is all the way colored. Um, also, they gave him the darker blue, which I hate dark blue. I'm sorry, y'all. I do. This blue is fine. This was the dark blue I hated at first compared to Mario, but it's fine. Complete reversal from Luigi. No dot in the old one's eye. Dot in the new one. And they got that printed tech. I have a gradient. Uh, off the back, I'm seeing some stuff on the outside. These knees look kind of bad now. Because you got these. That's seamless for the most part. Um, I'm going to have to open this and check it out. But I can tell it's going to be a huge upgrade compared to this one. Well, maybe not huge, but i got a feeling there's going to be some hidden changes here if you will stay tuned